Hey, what's up? This is the Mini Mate Master, and on today's Mini, we have a very special Toys R Us exclusive 4-pack, Captain America Through the Ages. Now, before this box gets opened, let's take a look at the packaging. And it is very uh, visually appealing, um, if I do say so myself. Um, basically, the whole back paneling is the American flag, very appropriate. Uh, up here, you know, you got the stars, or the stars, the blue, and you got the stripes running across it. Um, you got the Toys R Us exclusive seal right there in the center, and then you got a nice open window of all the characters. Um, you got World War II, suspended animation, armored, and reborn. Um, down here is Captain America through the ages. On this side, as well as the other side, you got a picture of all the characters. You got World War II, suspended animation, armored, and reborn. On the back, you have a nice picture of all the characters, the American flag in the background again. And all the characters have read-ups. For World War II, it says, The first successful recipient of the Super Soldier Serum, Steve Rogers, was transformed into America's perfect weapon in their fight against evil. This mini-may includes distinctive war helmet, classic badge, shield, and World War II-styled ammunition belt. Um, one of the things I don't really like is in the descriptions how they like say that it's a mini mate, you know? Like, I don't know, that just kind of annoys me. Three, I think three of them do that. Um... Or two of them. Anyway, um, for suspended animation, it says, thought, th thought lost to the world forever in the closing days for World War II, Steve Rogers was discovered frozen alive and was brought back to life in the modern age. Featuring an outfit that shows both his military and superhero uniforms and a half-melted block of ice, this might be the most unique mini mate ever. See what I mean? Like That just kind of doesn't sound right. Uh, for Armored, it says, Facing the deterioration of his body and possible paralysis, Steve Rogers had no choice but to don this armor so he could continue his fight for freedom. While short-lived, this might be one of the most unique looks for Captain America. And for Reborn, it says, Thought to be dead after being assassinated during the events of Civil War, Steve Rogers is found to be alive but caught between time and space. Retrieved by X-Shield agent Sharon Carter and Mr. Fantastic, Rogers returns to the iconic role of Captain America. So, there you have it for packaging. Let's get this sucker opened up and take a look at the figures. Stay tuned. Now for the first figure, World War II Captain America. And a really, really cool figure. I mean, this this guy is really cool. Um, it's not like the Ultimates World War II. It's, uh, I don't know, something different about it. But, um, as you can see, the colors um, and just the presentation of the character are, are done really well. Um, I don't know, the colors almost are more of a dingy, almost washed out sort of a red with a little brown mixed in there. The blue is a little dingier, you know. I mean, it looks good. Um, the whole thing looks really good. Um, notable pieces. Uh, we got this just top shoulder piece, kind of like the, um, uh, suitcase armor Iron Man mini mate. Just the top of the torso piece. Normal Captain America boots with the flared edges. Um, and he's got the Ultimate Captain America belt, you know, canteen and whatnot. Um, and a new thing that I'm really happy about, and that's really, it's a really good idea, whoever thought of that should get a raise, stat, um, pretty much a double idea, but it's like, as you can see, uh, it's, you get the red hand, but it is not connected to the flare part of the gauntlet, um, instead it is, like on this arm, instead it is just a separate piece. Um, and that way it's a lot easier, uh, and it's not always falling off. Um, and another thing is that, uh, to that flare part, they've added the peg already, so you don't have to take it off and, you know, put the thing on. Just mold it right on it. And, uh, you know, it, it's really, it's a really nice feature. Um, and speaking of that peg, um, you get a nice badge shield, um, you know, World War II style Captain America shield. And that just, uh... Just pops right on. But yeah, I mean, you can take the mask off. Um, he does come with a hairpiece. And it's more of a buzzed look, like he's in the military. Um, it is the same hairpiece uh, used by Shocker. Um, um, he does come with an alternate mask. Um, if you want to take the outer piece off. You know, um, and you can put this mask on right here. Um, 
It looks all right. It's not my preference. I'd have the other one for sure. But, you know, it, it's it's nice. It's more of a World War II style mask of Captain America's. But, um, but yeah, I mean, just just great detailing. Um, presented really well. Uh, this guy's gone on display for sure. So, um, yeah, I mean, overall, a, a nice figure. But he's the first of four, so stay tuned for the other three figures. Like the box said, this next movie is probably one of the most unique and that is suspended animation Captain America. Very, very cool. Very cool. I mean, it's a great concept for a figure. I'm surprised it hasn't been done before, but it probably couldn't have been pulled off before. Um, I mean, you got like a, as if you were just frozen in ice, um, like a torn military uniform, uh, exposing the Captain America garb. Um, the tears and paint is, is done really well, uh, where, where all the tears are. It's very pretty neat for the most part, which was surprising, um, unfortunately surprising. Uh, but, uh, I don't know, he looks great. He's got the uh, Nova hairpiece, but blonde. Like Justin Bieber hair swoop, you know, just in case he's going to go out singing. Uh, on the back, uh, he's got a nice uh, new piece, if I remove his, his head. Um, Got a nice little, uh, I don't know, it's a new piece, and it's representing, like, a mask hanging off of his back, good, which is also a good idea, I, I thought, I mean, pretty cool, we'll probably do more heroes with things like that now, um, but yeah, they, I think it pulled, it pulled off pretty well, um, he's got one over piece, and it's the belt piece, remove it, whatever. But yeah, I mean, the painting and everything is done really well. So, and they it's got the same gauntlet feature. Um, he does come with a shield for that peg right there. Peg that in there. Got a nice little Captain America shield. And you can remove the hair. And it comes with an alternate mask. So, I mean, you probably want to remove the this thing on the back there. Um, but yeah, it comes with a, a mask. It's kind of loose, but can be fixed. And one of the most uh, unique mini mate accessories probably ever is uh, the block of ice that Captain Rick was frozen in. And yes, they have done it for mini mates. Set the block of ice, set Captain Rick in there, and it is as if he is frozen in ice, which is pretty awesome. So, but yeah, that's uh, Captain. Captain America in suspended animation form. Uh, next, we will take a look at uh, armored Captain America. So, stick around. Now, like the box said, uh, although short-lived, uh, a really cool look for Captain America. Um, it says armor costume. Um, well, it looks it looks really cool. Um, I know. I think it uh, really feeds off the the character. Um, Unique pieces, we got uh, the helmet, it's still got the wings molded on, but it's got uh, like a ear, a place for the ears, right here, a um, little, little checkered detailing on the back of it, and um, you know, you got a big slit for the eyes and then a part for the mouth, um, you can kind of see the eyes, it's a little squinted, but, um, and you got the A, it looks nice, um, and you got this chest piece, uh, i take it off, you don't have to remove the head, which is nice, um, you can just remove the mask and then slide it right off um underneath you got some detailing but uh the piece has got sort of like a you know shoulder pads and it's got a place on the collar around it uh star and stripes on front and back looks very cool um also utilizing the cuff the cuff gloves um with a little star on it and he's got the peg on it as well so and then he's got very cool boots um you got the knee pad part of it painted blue and the boot part of it red. Um, haven't seen these boots before. Sure we will in the near future. Um, he does come with a hairpiece. So if you want him uh, without the helmet. He's got, a, he's got an interesting. nice sculp Nicely sculpted might add hairpiece. So if you want him without it. That's fine. And then he comes with a shield. So you can pop that back on. 
yeah, overall, I'm um, really cool, um, really unique, and really well done. So uh, kudos to whoever designed this box and this figure. Um, they're really stepping up their game. I mean, it's especially the Toys R Us exclusive ones. So that's Captain America in his armored version. Last but not least, we have Captain America Reborn. Here's Captain America Reborn. Um, at first look, I thought he was a lot like the uh, Captain America from the uh, Toys R Us exclusive pack with Battle Damaged Wolverine. Um, but I mean, aside from the colors, that's really about all that's similar. Um, he's got the cuff boots. Um, well, I guess that's also similar. Um, he's got cuff boots. He's also got the straps on, uh, so he's got the peg on his back. So if I bring it in here, pop his shield on his back. Very cool. Um, a nice mask. It's got the wings and the A and some shadowing detailing on it. Also utilizing the cuff gloves with the brown straps and peg. So if you want to remove it that from there, you can pop it on his forearm and he's holding his shield. Um, some nice, de nice but basic uh, detailing on the legs. Um, the belt is also nice. Um, got some pouches on the back, and it's got the belt buckle painted a nice silver. Um, and then the detailing on the chest is where I'm, I'm really uh, astounded. Um, got some nice like ab and uh, pack detailing. Looks very good. Um, and then they got this one other thing I like is not just a few you know scales miscellaneously placed here and there all over it. You got all scales all the way around, <clears throat> even on the back. So, and then you got the star and stripes. Um, but yeah, um, yeah, that's about it for Captain America Reborn. Uh, overall though, I would have to say, um, this is a really nice, really nice pack. So if you're out at Toys R Us, uh, and you happen to see this, definitely pick it up. Uh, it's something you probably don't want to miss out on. Um, well, get it while you still can. Uh, holidays are coming up, so you don't want to get snatched by someone who doesn't know anything about mini mates, because that would be bad. Anyway, that was the Captain America Through the Ages mini mate box set. Stay tuned, rate, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. Peace!